for coming to help out at our at our church to be able to uh, connect up with our gardens. They're, they're really been a blessing to our community, and your help to make that happen, I'm grateful for. I just want to sh share with what you with what I'm thankful for, especially to God. I like this community that we're a part of, and La Mesa is a beautiful community, and I'm glad that we at St. Andrews can be part of it, and that you, you've helped become part of this community yourself. You know, when we had that struggle with trying to, to present the community garden idea, there was a lot of ang anxious people, but you were there, and uh, I want to thank you for what you did, for speaking positively about it. You know, what keeps me hopeful in our community is that people are trying to connect up. And I'm beginning to find that the, probably the only way we really connect up is as we find those things that bond us together. And one of them is our faith. And I know you have a, a faith level in your walk. And I just wanted to share a little bit of my faith with you. Um, what keeps me hopeful is that in all of the difficulty that I have to work with, with people and events and struggles in people's lives, I find that Jesus has been present for me to help me listen and hear and care. And when I feel overwhelmed, just to know that it's not me, that it is Him who can see us through and see me through. Um, when I'm overwhelmed at times, I, I find that just getting some time to talk, talk with Jesus on the side, walking away or walking around something, it really, it really helps sustain me. It's we call it prayer, but really it's just conversation with one who knows us better than we know him. He still wants us to connect up with him. So I find that as I pray, as I, as I study the, 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 these words of written in the Bible that speak about Jesus and tell Jesus' words to us, I feel that helps me keep grounded in my life. When I get stressed, I find that I can turn it over to him because he says, I want, he wants to take my struggles. And I know, brother, he wants to take your struggles too because I know you've got a, lot, a big chunk of weight on your shoulders by what you have to deal with in this town. And again, I thank you for your leadership. I've got to tell you, because of this walk with Jesus, I can be at, at peace because I, I get that time with him. I can enjoy what I do, and I want you to know that you're in my thoughts and prayers too. And I'd love to hear what your story of your faith has been, and I look forward to hearing about it someday. Bless you, brother.